Hi everyone, I have a new build for you. Can you guess it by just looking at me what I'm actually using? Ah, uh, you're gonna laugh at me, Fighters Bandic, but not the Gilded one. Not the Gilded one. Let's take a look. So this one is a Fighters Binding based um, build that uses, well, Thundering. And not just this, Chains! And I really wanted to use other enchantments. Finally, something different. Both Thundering and Chains. Uh, and you're gonna hear about it. This is kind of a really cool synergy happening here. Uh, so, Thundering, all right? This is lots of damage, right? 30% chance, but with the fight is binding because it's a very fast weapon. Well, especially when we have Death Cap Mushroom, which increase our attack speed and movement speed. Uh, we're gonna deal, uh, a Thundering will take place uh, very often, all right? This is great. I'm just gonna show you against the doll, and soon you're gonna jump into cow level to have some fun with this. Alright, so let's take a look. And now with mushroom, you see? It's almost continuous. Yeah. Amazing. So, what I have here? Another new armor that I'm using. Can you believe it? A new one. And this is Island Armor. Now this one comes with game speed uh after jaw dodge, so I can actually gain more speed, which is nice. This means that I actually don't have any speed here, and I love being speedy, especially, come on, we are kind of insane bolt here, uh -huh, you know, <coughs> insane bolt. Uh, so again, we need to be very, very speedy. So, um, of course, I can be even more speedy, by the way, if I use, um, if I use boost of swiftness, which you can do if you like to be very, more, very speedy. Uh, but again, it's actually nice having such a lot of elements. Just in case you connect the lightning, I can deal it like 18 million damage. Crazy! Oh, to up to seven enemies. This is insane. So we also have this is a gilded one. Comes with zap enemies when rolling, which is crazy. Uh, and this is 250. I'm just gonna show you that it deals, as you can see here, million damage, right? A million damage with just zapping, but just rolling. And when I roll, take a look, I have the short bow, which also has a uh, cooldown shot and bow bursting to reduce the cooldowns of my abilities when I roll near enemies and shoot them. But just rolling, not manually shooting them. And we have shockwave, which lightning, all right? So we deal damage to lightning as well, right? Lightning, lots of lightnings, but no lightning road here. I don't want this in this build. Uh, now, the idea is that we're having coward dice as well, Potion Barrier. Great! This is a very good draw, by the way. Uh, because this one we're going to deal plus 30 melee damage. We already have plus 30, right? And we have plus 40 if we are full health. So are we actually going to have full health most of the time? We need to reduce the damage. So this already comes with 35% damage reduction, right? And not just that. Because we are keeping enemies away from us and dealing with less enemies because we're going to chain them, right? So this means less enemies attacking us, especially those speedy ones that run after us. So this means less damage. So Coward Dice will be kind of at the top, right? The HP will keep on getting to be very high because they're going to be using Radiance. At this time, we are keeping enemies away. We're also dealing damage with Thundering. So you can see all this synergy here, right? Great! So we have Mushroom, Dead Crypt Mushroom. I run that amulet, by the way, for extra synergy because, again, uh, when we get less uh, damage, the iron amulet, we can actually keep because the upper, uh, because we reduce, th this reduces the incoming damage. So actually, Radiance can keep up even more and fill up more so we can actually be at the maximum HP and more, uh, uh, more frequently and therefore dealing more damage. This is great. Uh, Satchel of Elements, because if we connect the 18 million damage that this one can deal, this is insane. Um, this is just crazy. Uh, we can deal lots of damage here, right? Not 18 million. I don't know. Uh, we're going to go and, and, and have fun and, have fun and uh, see how it goes. I said 18 million. I don't know why I said 18 million. Never mind that. So, um... To have some something more, you know, lots of enemies have fun. Uh, we're gonna go to uh, here. We're gonna do this in plus twenty-five. Come on, let's give it a chance. So you can see, actually, uh, again, of course, many enemies won't be as powerful as in tanky. I mean, powerful tanky as cows. So if it works here well, of course, it's gonna work very well. 
I guess the and mobs and other kind of uh, many small enemies. All right, and there are many enemies here. That's why I want to try it out. So let's go. You see the distance already. Now it's actually preventing from coming close to me. All right. So I'm going to get less damage. I don't need to do with many enemies at the same time. Now look at the cowardice. is active here. Right? And when I get less damage, of course, cowardice will keep up with that. Now let's use, you see? Oh, yeah. How much it? It was crazy. How much was it? It was insane. Right? You see? I'm getting much less damage. And cowardice, take a look at the left side, will be active more frequently. Alright, so we're gonna do much more damage like that. Alright? And this is great! This is insane crowd control! Just insane! And of course the lighting will connect to enemies that are nearby. Ah, by the way, we can roll. I didn't even roll. I'm sorry. I, I didn't even roll. You need to see this. We are gonna have lots of fun here. Look at this. They are chained, not coming close to us. We are dealing damage. We can roll. If I use everything, of course, it's going to be just crazy. Nice. And also, the fight is binding also kind of a stagger enemy because it kind of uh, deals damage so fast. Again, I can roll and zap and I deal lots of damage when I do this, right? Now, we need to understand that everything here is buffed because of the lightning focus i haven't even mentioned this this is the main thing plus 75 increased lightning damage so this one zapping this one lightning shockwave everything is just buffed with uh and of course thundering the damage is buffed even more all right so we get lots of crowd control and damage and this is great by the way for um for this DLC, even before, because there are lots of enemies, and uh, it just works well to keep things in bay, not let them rush to you so fast, and especially when daily tries, you know, when they kind of speed up the the, the speed of the um, of the enemies, right? And this is great also for creepers, of course, creepers. They run after you, just dealing with an enemy, and then they gum at you and just boom. So now. They won't be able to. They will probably die by the time they get close to you. It's great. <laughs> this is so much fun. I'm going to activate the potion. Well, I don't need to uh, because I'm just. Let's burn them. It's just amazing seeing them just posing. <laughs> so much fun. Crazy. It's amazing. You see, I'm just dealing with only few enemies at the same time. This is just insane crowd control. Of course, I can roll. Deal more damage. Again, when I roll, I can even roll here. I'm going to zap enemies. Bye-bye. <laughs> Let's roll. Look at what's happening. It's crazy. It's also beautiful on the screen, by the way. Oh, thanks for the level up healing. <laughs> oh my god. Crazy. Look at this. Look at the chaining. It's just insane. Like if you wanted better crowd control than this. This is crazy. And there's also synergy with... Um, by the way, with the satchel of element, when you uh, reduce the speed, because again, it reduces the incoming damage. So when even when you activate it, the enemies are slower. So there's another synergy here again with, of course, with the coward dice, because again, we're keeping damage very, very low, right? So everything is kind of amazing synergy, and it works so well. Now, one last thing regarding um, uh, Gong. I don't use Gong because I'm separating enemies with the chains. So I'm not going to use like a few enemies, the Gong, and the cooldown is long. Such a lot of elements is much better choice here, especially when we have a Thundering. Uh, and uh, for you can eat multiple enemies. So definitely, uh, you think, a better choice here. Uh, you're going to gain also more time to react 
for the cooldown to reduce because you can roll uh, and enemies are not really you kind of separate enemies from you with the chain so overall i think it's a better choice so this is it for this build I hope you enjoyed this one make sure you leave a comment suggestion tips questions in the comment section below and don't forget to leave a little like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so many of you haven't subscribed yet so make sure you subscribe and i see you very soon on the next video thanks for watching this one cheers bye bye